Hi guys, so right now I'm getting ready to do some reorganizing on my makeup. I recently got a new vanity and there's Muffin. Look how cute she is with her octopus. So I recently got this new vanity from my husband and this is from Ikea. I believe this is called the Mick Desk. And I've been wanting to get a white vanity forever so I was so happy when he got this for me. This one is a little bit bigger than my mom. And then this one has two drawers instead of one, which I really love. So right now I'm just getting ready to organize the makeup inside of the drawers and then on top. Once I get done with everything, I'll do a video and kind of give you guys a little vanity tour and show you guys how I have everything set up. So basically I just got done going through my collection and tossing out anything that was old or getting rid of anything that I am not using. Sometimes people ask what I do with the stuff that I'm not using and usually I stick it in a bag and I let my friends and family go through it and see if there's anything they want. I really don't like holding on to makeup that I'm not using because I just don't really see any point in it. And lately I really try not to buy any makeup unless I know that I'm going to use it because I really do not need. I don't even need as much as I have, but I don't think I have as much as I used to in the years past. I'm pretty happy with my collection as it is right now. Muffin! She's so cute laying here with her octopus. What are you doing? Do you want to say hi? She always has to get up. If I tell her to say hi, she has to get up first. Muffin. Ooh. You wanna say hi? Are you happy? She has a bald spot by her ear. Can you see that? She has a bald spot. So right now it's just kind of a beautiful disaster in here. I've got makeup and stuff everywhere. I also wanted to mention I have been getting quite a few questions about this purse right here where I got this from and I actually bought that I want to say two or three years ago from the flea market and I know it's not real or anything. I think it's what they call a replica and I just thought it was really pretty and it was only $20 and then it came with a wallet in a sunglass case which I don't even know. I think I gave those away, but I just mainly bought this because I thought it was pretty, so kind of like for a room decoration, and I could not pass up $20, so for those of you asking, it is a flea market find. Oh, and I also wanted to show you guys this cute little container here that I got from Bath & Body Works. I thought this was really cute. I've seen people putting candles in there, but I decided to store a couple of my Benefit eyeshadows in there. All right, should we get back to organizing? Should we get back to work? So I feel like it has been forever since I've done any vlog type videos and a lot of you guys have been requesting more vlogs and shopping videos. So today I'm going to try to vlog. My mom is on her way over right now and we are going to go to Target and TJ Maxx and maybe even a few other places. I feel like I'm having shopping withdrawal because it's been quite a while since I've been shopping because I just got over being sick. I had a terrible cold. First Bill got it and then he spread it to me. So lucky me I got to be sick for a week. But I am thankful that I do not have the flu because that is going around really bad so I would definitely take a cold over the flu any day anyways um we got some more snow it snowed I think about four inches last night I don't think we're gonna ever get rid of this snow I'm definitely ready for spring so anyways I thought I would just take you guys along with us for our little shopping trip today so I'm gonna go because my mom should be here any second so I will talk to you guys soon bye hi oh I want to show you guys look I have my little claw here my little snow scraper I bought this a couple years ago at Yonkers and I love this thing because you just stick your hand on the inside of it and then you can scrape your window and it looks like you have a giant paw for a hand so cute we have arrived at Target and it's still snowing okay our first stop at Target is usually always the dollar section this little cheapy section what do you need some pens Oh, look, they have Crayola Kleenex. Those are really cute. Lately, they've been having some really super good stuff in this little cheapy section. I always get hooked on buying the little stationery. Where's all their cute pens? 
feel like these would be really cute for Easter to fill with some little goodies. And these right here kind of remind me of the ones from Ikea and they're only $1. Don't you think those would be cute for Easter? And then I also found this bigger bucket, but this one is three. I feel like I still sound really congested. I just spotted the pocket hose and I just wanted to let you guys know that these things are freaking terrible. I think we had like four of them and they all got holes in them within a few days and they pretty much suck. I did find a couple other things in the dollar section. I found these little bunny ear clips and this bunny tail and no, I'm not going to be wearing these in my hair for clips. I'm going to use these for a DIY and then I did end up getting some of the little tins. I feel like our card's like a really crappy, nasty card as usual. Ooh, those bras are pretty. We spotted these really pretty mint and gold mirrors. And they're, I don't know if you can tell, but they're kind of sparkly. Woo! Here's a lamp like I have in my office. I feel like it's been forever since I've been to Target. Oh my gosh! I found a little baby SpongeBob couch and chair. I'm gonna get these for the dogs and they're on clearance. <laughs> yes, uh, it's $69.96. It's $69.96. <laughs> now we're coming up on some of the storage and organization I wanted to show you guys. These are the ones that I showed in my vanity video. These were, weren't these on clearance or were they on sale the last time? I thought they were on sale or clearance last time and now they're not. So that's what they look like. They're exhilaration stackable trays. And then I'll show you guys. Oh, they also have them in black with a zebra type print. I'll show you guys where they have the acrylic ones. Okay, I think they're down here. This is like the little closet organization aisle. Yep, there they are. Looks like they're out of the small ones. The small ones are normally $3.69 and these big ones are only $6.29. So if you guys are looking for these for organizing your vanity, this is the aisle that they are in. I feel like I've been having Target withdrawals. Like it's been forever since I've been here. Look, we found a turtle at Target. A gold turtle. And it opens. I also found this really pretty tray. Whoa, that's really heavy. Look how pretty that is. Might have to get that. I spotted that giant cheeseburger from my last Target vlog. It's the giant cheeseburger. Here, you hold the burger. Let's pretend like you're taking a bite of it. <laughs> okay, now we've made our way into the Easter section. Look. Easter, Easter everywhere. And check out this giant cotton candy. I don't know. They had these giant cotton candies last year and I thought they were really cool. Look at this giant bunny. How cute is that? I would never eat that much chocolate though. Well, okay. I lied. I would. I have some sparkly Easter eggs. Hey, I found another turtle. Two turtles in Target. What is that? I guess it just holds eggs. That would be really cute for an Easter egg hunt. Then the kids could, you could hide the eggs and they could collect them in these. I wish we had some little kids around at Easter. I know, I just saw those. My mom just now saw the sparkly eggs. Oh, they have EOS and some new packaging. I already have these ones, but every time I see them in new packaging, it just makes me want to buy them again. Do any of you guys do that? Found the goldfish and this adorable spring packaging and spring Oreos. My mom said, what did you say after you were holding that cheeseburger? Hungry. She's hungry now. The cheeseburger <laughs> made her hungry. Kind of hungry too. We've been um, going to KFC and getting the little Go Cups. Is that what it's called? The Go Cup? Yeah. That wreath is pretty. They're bunny shaped. Bunny shaped pretzels? I just realized they also had vanilla cupcake goldfish. I didn't even notice that. Have you guys tried these? If they are any good, let me know. Or this little tin's really cute. I didn't see that. I think this is from the dollar section and somebody ditched it over here. Oh, I might have to get that one too. For some Easter DIY stuff. Oh, look at all the Easter candy. These little carrots are adorable. We 
we have made our way over to the office supply aisle. I don't know why I always love looking at the cute little notebooks and pens. I really like this owl. I'm kind of at a point where I really don't need any more notebooks. I like this one though. They always have really pretty ones here. Look at the little dog. I don't know why. I really love looking at office supplies. Like, when I see this, it just makes me feel happy. Is that weird? Okay, there's somebody randomly yelling penis in the store. Look at this hat. What do you guys think? See if they see it. You like my new hat? Think I should get this? Did you hear that guy yelling out penis? what the hell? <laughs> Did you hear my mom? She says, what the hell was that? That, say it again. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> I don't know. He was a weirdo. I'm so curious if these nail art pens work good. These are by Sally Hansen. If you guys have tried these, let me know if they're any good. Oh, they changed this. See, I've been sick and I've been gone for so long that they started changing everything around. Look how different this looks. Here's a bunch of the physician's formula. I really don't need any more makeup, so. I've been trying to kind of not buy so much and use up what I have. But occasionally if I see something that's really awesome, then I buy it. Like baby lips, I really don't need any more of those. I've been actually going through quite a few. I've went through, I think I've used up three or four of them in the last few months. And lately the Dr. Rescue ones have been my favorite since it's winter. Okay, before we left Target, we decided to come to Starbucks. And I saw these really cool, they have them. They're not the plasticky cups, they're actually glasses. These are kind of neat. And these are $9.95. I'm getting a green tea frappuccino. We're just leaving Target and we decided to stop at Starbucks on the way out and I got my favorite green tea frappuccino even though it's freezing outside. It's still snowing as you can see. Look at all of our snow. Hi guys, so I just got back from shopping and I thought I would just quickly kind of show you guys the things that I picked up. So, um, I didn't do any vlogging in TJ Maxx and I just got two things. This is kind of random, but I got some socks. Um, I needed some really thick socks, so I just bought some of these men's socks. They're Columbia brand. Hopefully these are going to fit and they're not going to be like too huge or anything. But it says shoe size 6 to 12, so I think they should be good. Um, I just needed some thick winter socks, so I got some men's. And then I got another paperweight. I'll show you guys that in just a second because I have to unwrap it. From Target, I got some of the Raspberry Chocolate Milanos. These things are so good. And then I got, I think I showed you guys these in the store, some of these bunny ear hair clips, which I'm not going to use in my hair. I'm going to use them for a DIY, as well as the clip-on bunny tail. How cute is that? And then from the little cheapy section, I got some of these tins. I got two of these white ones. These actually remind me quite a bit of the ones from Ikea. I'll show you guys in a second. This bunny tin. All of these were a dollar except for this big one, which was three dollars. We went to the dollar store and I just picked up some jelly beans and then some of these containers. I thought I could use these to store some cereal in. And then did I get anything else? Oh, these are not from the dollar store. I just had these in my cart and I just decided to throw them in there and bring them in. This mask here, this is one of the masks that you can stick in your refrigerator. I like using these when I have a headache. It has the little beads. They also had these in green, so I just decided to get one. And then I got some of these little carrot candies for Easter basket stuff. We went to Meyer. <laughs> Muffin sitting here. Say hi. <coughs> yeah. We <laughs> went to Meyer and I picked up some dog treats. My dogs love these treats. They are from the Blue Dog Bakery. They're made in the USA and they are all natural and low fat. And they're peanut butter and molasses flavor. Look, it's like they know that these are treats. Ooh, they love these. 
Okay, I'm gonna show you guys that pot. I think I set it in my office. Oh. Turn on the light so we can actually see. Okay. Here it is. This one here is from Ikea and then this one is from Target. I'm not sure how much these were at Ikea. I can't remember if they were $3.50 or $4, but this is the one from Target and it's basically the same size and they look very similar. I can't remember what they're called. It's a weird name. So if you're looking for something like these, definitely check Target in their little dollar section. I also wanted to mention, I get a lot of questions about this crayon calculator back here. I have had that since I think I was in middle school and I was at my mom's house a couple months back cleaning out some of my old stuff and I found it. But if you guys are looking for something like that, I think you can find them on Amazon and on eBay. Hi guys, so I'm back again with another haul. I thought I would show you guys some of the stuff that I got from my favorite store, Target for 90% off after Valentine's Day. And right now I'm just sitting here in my pajamas and I still feel like kind of stuffy nose. A lot of you guys were asking about these awesome donut pajamas and I asked my mom where they were from and she said she got them from Kmart. So I'm not sure if they still have them or not, but you could definitely check it out. Okay, so first of all, like I said, all of this stuff was 90% off. I think for all of it I paid around 18 or 20 dollars and normally it would have been 150 so I got some really good deals a few of the things I got um I think I might give away to like my sister or my niece I'm not really sure because I got some extras of some stuff so first of all I'm going to start out with a couple dog toys that I got look how cute these are they're little cotton candies I got actually three of them I had seen these when they had them for regular price which I seen most of the stuff and I just thought it was Kind of ridiculously priced so I usually wait until it goes on clearance so I think these were 30 or 40 cents they're so cute and some of you guys I posted a picture on Instagram were asking if this stuff comes off and I have not had any problems and they've been playing with the one for about two weeks I have muffin sitting here can you see her she's sitting here with her favorite she brings this toy everywhere <coughs> octopus Next, I got this cute little heart basket. I picked up three of these picture frames because they were only 50 cents. I think I might give a few of these away. This super pretty heart wreath, I had wanted to get this when it was regular price, but this thing was $20 and I did not want to spend $20 on a Valentine's Day wreath, so I think I ended up paying about $2 for this. Some candy eyeballs. I got my dogs each a new food dish. I think these were only around a dollar or a dollar fifty a piece. They're really cute. They have little hearts and polka dots on them. Here, you want some food? She sniffs in the bowl. She's like, there's nothing in there. Okay, this is random. It's just laying here, but I also got this from the dollar store. They have some really pretty bright pink and blue and purple baskets right now, probably because spring is coming. I picked up two of these little ceramic containers. These are really cool because you can write on them with a piece of chalk. It just says, I heart, and then you can write anything that you want, whatever you want to fill this up with. And I think those were 30 or 40 cents. I got a Valentine's Day banner that says, what does it say? Love you so much. Not that I needed another one, but I thought this one was really cute. I also cute. picked up this ceramic treat jar for the puppies to store some of their treats in. Just looks like a cookie jar. Just has a little bone on top. That's for you. You look so cute laying on your octopus. Can you guys see her? You look so cute. Aww. She's wanting a treat. I bought him some treats earlier. Oh, now she's sniffing the, the brownie mitt. You wanna show this next? Okay, I got this too hot to handle oven mitt and on the inside it has brownie mix. Some paper straws. And now she wants to sniff everything. Is there something, oh yep. Two of these little heart decorations. Does that smell good? Another one of these heart boxes. I already had two of these, but I love them so much. And this was only 50 cents, so I was really excited when I found another one because you can never have too many cute storage boxes to hide all of your clutter and junk. 
What else we get? Ooh, that's breakable. Um, another one of these. A sign that says Foxy. Are you Foxy? And then I got the unicorn salt and pepper shakers. I just thought these were adorable. I'm probably not going to use these for salt and pepper shakers. These were, I think, 30 cents each. They're so cute. I'm getting tired. And then this might be the last thing from Target is this heart tray. And this was $2. Ew, there was some hair. Gross. There's hair on it. I don't know why I get grossed out when there's like dog hair or something on stuff. Sometimes I get grossed out by hair. And then I went to Kohl's and I also got some stuff on clearance. I guess I went a little bit Valentine's Day crazy, but I really like decorating for Valentine's Day. I got some of these Valentine's Day dish towels and they say be mine with the cute little dog. And then this is what the other one looks like. Can you leave me? I got this for my guest bathroom. It is a Valentine's Day shower curtain. And then I got this also for the guest bathroom. And I'm not going to have this up all the time. This is just going to be for Valentine's Day. I got a heart rug. It's beautiful. And I think that was it. Is that everything? Is that everything, Beef? It's kind of random, and I don't know if you guys know, but a lot of times I call Muffin Beef, which is short for Beefcake. I have a lot of nicknames for my dogs. I don't know if you guys do that, but I call them so many different names. Come here, Beefcake. You're my Beefcake. I got your octopus. Come here. I'm just going to trip over all this stuff. Come here. Say hi. Do you want to say hi? You want to say hi? <laughs> say hi, YouTube. Say yeah. Say I love you. Hi guys, good morning. Today is a beautiful day. The sun is shining and it seems so nice to see the sun shining. I'm so excited for spring. Hopefully that's not too blinding. I forgot to show you guys a couple things that I picked up from Target yesterday. So the first thing is this gold mirrored tray that I showed you guys when I was in Target. This is the tray that was next to the gold turtle. And then I also ended up getting this really cute little bunny back here. I think I'm going to use this to store some little paper clips. I love Target so much. Seriously, I just love Target.